All right, all right. What's going on, YouTube? What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, King David. Let's go. Let's get it. Shout out to my new subscribers, my old school subscribers, my TikTok family. It wasn't for you guys. None of this would be possible. Shout out to my replay gang, gang, gang. Shout out to overseas, my overseas gang, gang, gang. And to my unsubscribed gang, gang, gang. If you're unsubscribed, go ahead and subscribe. Take a moment. Go ahead and do that. Da, 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 da. We are not doing this. Um, what else? What else? What else? You guys are good. All right. You know what I'm saying. Shout out to my members. We we'll have a video coming to you this afternoon. Me and my son are going to be going on a walk, so it's definitely going to be a members video of us going on the walk. But I'll probably make another video um just for the subscribers you know what i'm saying so um expect that video later on the day and hey, listen guys i appreciate all the uh, love and support you pour into the channel all the likes and shares and the comments you know what i'm saying it wasn't for you guys you know like i say all the time none of this be possible you know what i mean so i appreciate it continue doing what you're doing with the likes i'm not gonna tell you what to do you're already doing it just continue to do the great things you're doing with the likes and shares and the comments all right that being said all the great love and energy pour into the channel. I mean, to pour the same of energy as you guys and blessings with this dope video. Try not to cuss. All right. You've seen the title, right? So let's talk about it. Listen, I want to talk about, you know, some keys to success. And, you know, I just want to show my appreciation, right? I want to also get on here. You know, and let you guys know that the format that we have right now is going to be the one I'm sticking with. Um, I will be uploading um, just NARC videos to the NARC Bully channel, and then I will be posting them on this channel so you can catch those. But there's going to be a lot of positivity going on because we're in a growth uh, phase of this where we're past all of the, um, the abuse and the trauma. And if you're in the abuse and trauma, I want to give you something to look at to show you how the other side looks which, you know, it looks really good. So we're going to stay on that, keeping it positive. I don't care what end up in, where we end up in the algorithm. We're just going to continue to get this message out, trying to make sure people get back to God and stay on that love, happy, laughing. You know, I do a lot of different things. I get on TikTok and I work out. And I'm always like, yeah, I work out shirtless. You, under, you got to understand that part of being happy and, and the way that I keep my child like, and I'll be dancing in my house and stuff to myself. Like, you, you got to keep that child mentality, man. Like, you got to have that imagination, and you have to be laughing, right? That's part of healing, too, is laughing. So, you know, I get on there, and I get goofy, you know? Because, for one, you shouldn't take yourself too serious. I'm doing that. And also, you should keep it childlike, and you should spread joy to everybody else. So I could just be in my own house dancing to myself like I normally do, working out. But instead, I'm trying to spread that energy, you know, because it's a clean, pure energy. I have no you know, ill intent. I'm not doing things for any malicious reasons. And I like spreading that joy. Just like coming over here. I want to make sure that I'm spreading, especially in the AM, some kind of positive, um, you know what I'm saying? Energy. I'm not, it's not going to always be about like, you know, the narcs out to, out to get us and all. Yeah. Okay. But we've already learned that it's all about us and our own energy. These people and are possessed, you know, the spirit and you know, if we know that they can't take charge over our energy, right? The only thing they can do, they have no power. The only thing they can do is try to manipulate us through words, wordplay, which is spells. That's why you see most narcissists have to tell you all about themselves and what they're going to do to you to get into your mind, to brainwash you into thinking they have power. If you have power, you shouldn't have to speak about it. Just do it. No, they don't have any power. So they're always running their mouth about something. I can do this and I can do that. And I'm a this and I'm a that. I'm zoning all that out. I cut all of it out. You have no power in my reality. I'm not going to give you my power to manipulate me into thinking that you have power. Obviously, I'm the powerful one. I don't tell nobody about nothing. I'd be like, they don't get whatever. I don't, I don't do what these crazies do online or, or speak up on my resume all the time. And that's someone that's weak. It has to constantly brainwash you with words to say, look, I'm this and I'm that. You shouldn't have to do that. Your actions, the way you move, should speak for themselves. I got a lot of people copying me. It used to bother me, right? I was giving them my power. I was giving these jokers my power and making them feel like they were somebody when obviously I'm the blueprint. So how did I take my power back? All right, okay. 
You guys are copying them. Okay, whatever. You're my, you're my children, my sons and my daughters. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to be making change and changing myself so often, you're not going to be able to keep up with me. I haven't even started yet. You're not going to be able to keep up with me. And because you're not going to be able to keep up with me, I don't know what you're going to do for yourselves. Take the old version of me from a couple months ago or try to predict what I'm going to do. You're not going to be able to. So once I took my power back, it's like I don't have to come on here and be a certain way or worry about these people don't look like me. They're not carrying a light like me. They're not outside shining off the light like me, right? Not fit like me. There's nothing to worry about. They can take all the information, regurgitate it. They can get views off of it, but they're not me. You know what I'm saying? I'm as happy as I can be. They can try to mimic that, which should help them in their life. We want them to try to be a better version. And we don't have no imposter uh, syndrome anymore. We know we're the real deal, right? We know we are. So whoever's mimicking us, it's just to be laughed at and we keep it trucking. You know, we're not worried about the copycat energy anymore. The narc energy, you know, which is a higher level, you know, than the copycat energy in itself. Because that has a whole, you know, that beast is disgusting. But we're not worried about them either. When they take these personal vendettas, I appreciate you, my man. I appreciate you. Salute and pound. Salute and pound. We're not going to let these narcs take our energy. We're fully focused on who we are. Listen, the only way you can let somebody take your energy is by listening to their words. You are, you are the most powerful being in your reality. When you give your power away, which is what social media teaches us to do, and, you know, society and, um, you know, the radio and TV is to give your power away by letting someone speak into existence all these different things that don't really matter. That's why they don't want you to go out in nature and stand in the moment, because when you do, you're like, this is all that matters right now. That fake reality of social media is not even real. It's a bunch of opinions by broken and hurt people that are bored. And it don't make no no difference to you. You step in it, you know, you jump in, you make a bunch of people mad, you jump out. I'm back in reality, right? So I can jump in it and say whatever I want to say, speak my mind, and then I'm back out of it. It don't it don't mean nothing to me, right? Everybody has their oh, I don't, why y'all keep blocking my dog on? Don't be blocking her. What's going on? What's going on, love? You know what I'm saying? How you doing? You know what I'm saying? So we just back, you know, we're in it. And we need to be in it, and we're out of it all day long. I'm in nature. I'm out here walking around, no shoes on, all kind of stuff out here, working out in the sun, getting that, you know what I'm saying, that energy in me. I don't really, I get on, on, on uh, YouTube and TikTok and post content. I piss people off all day long. Once I heal, I'm just like, I, when I go through the comments and someone's going off, I always be eat some chips and just be like, that's funny. Someone be funny, though. Someone be getting me good, y'all. I ain't going to lie. I'll be like, oh, that was funny. That was good. That was good. I'm not even going to lie. It was good because it don't even mean, it don't, it's all love. It's all love. The other side of that could be being a content creator and having no haters and no subs that really come through and watch your videos. I can change my platform over multiple times as I grow. As I'm growing and figuring myself out, my um, soul tribe rocks with me. They don't like, oh, he's not doing this narc stuff. I'm done. They don't be like, oh, he's not just doing fitness. No, they're like, he's evolving. They're just rolling with me. They know how it is. They're going through the same thing. So when you got the real ones with you, you don't have to, like, try hard to figure out what content to put up. Whatever the divine sends you, you put it out, and your soul tribe's going to vibe with it. Soul tribe, vibe tribe. I don't know who, what YouTuber I got that from. It was some young lady, but that vibe tribe thing is dope. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to her. You know, but, um. There's no need to get on here and try to impress people. There's no need to get on here and try to be a certain kind of way, worrying about what everybody else thinks. I have some, I have goofies on here that are trying to mimic me and taunt me. I'm playing chess with them. I'm all up in their head, rent free. They think I'm living on the internet like they are. I have a whole life, a real life. You have a miserable real life while you try to have a relationship with me online that I didn't agree to, right? So I'm just going to play a little bit of chess with you. It's all good while I'm online. Then I'll get offline and play with my son and ride my motorcycle. You know what I'm saying? Scratch my head, scratch my ass, whatever. You know what I mean? I'm not playing any silly mind games with you, though. So that being said, stand in your power. You know, I, I don't want to seem corny, but I don't care what word you use. Chosen one, star seed, you know, um, 
you know, one of God's, whatever, 140, whatever y'all want to call yourselves, right? It's really just people with the consciousness, right? You know, you got the Christ consciousness, you've elevated, you've ascended, and now you got demons trying to pull you back down to the 3D, like they love to do. We have elevated, we are on the five dimensional plane here, y'all. You know what I mean? And when you're in when you're in this bliss where you're just happy about life, you need nothing to make you happy about life, life itself and love of life and love of others and love of things is all you need. Every single day. You cannot wait until you rise to open your eyes and thank God and then go about your day. That's how it works. So when you see these haters that are just mad and coming at you, you're just like, it's okay. I still love you. It's okay. God loves you more. It's okay. We're still going to be here. We're not going anywhere. All right, y'all. I'm ending on that. I need to stay blessed. You know what I'm saying? Um, have a great day. I have more content coming this afternoon. Let me get off of here. I'm getting on TikTok and my workout. And spread some great energy. All right? You do the same. You being the beacon of light you are, you're spreading that great energy already to everybody around you. I can feel everyone ascending. Thank y'all for all the work you do. Stay blessed. Love you.